Psalms, Psalms, chapter 40, verse 11. Withhold not thy tender mercies from me, O Yahweh, O Shah. Let thy loving kindness of thy truth continually, continually preserve me. I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh, Bashim El Shah, Bashim the Wadi Al Bashim Al Shah for giving us the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who deserve the honors, rightfully so. Shalom all to the Akim, pushing the word of sincerity and truth, in truth, and being faith based and being prepared for what is to come. And what is to come? Race wars, famine, concentration camps, and all by deep ship with the mark of the beast. 200 million missiles in the soils of America. Simultaneously, the chairs of Lord opened the whole full life into the chambers. Simultaneously, the chairs of Lord. Shooting laser beams of the ungodly and the heathens, rightfully so. However, I desire the Lord to take the course of this video. I'm just a vessel seeking salvation. And boy, do we need it. We need it. Your remnant need it. <laughs> even, um, even the two-thirds need it. You know, the rest of the nations need it too. They need, they need, um, Salvation from this wicked man, Esau. They need to be. Everybody needs to be put back on the right path, under the jurisdiction of Yahweh Yahweh Shah. So, you know, only for you know, the Lord's not going to destroy all the nations. He's just going to destroy one nation. He meet and it's gone. Um, just to say that. All right, this is the um, I'm gonna go get that verse to prove that the Lord's gonna destroy one nation, one nation. All other nations are gonna keep. <coughs> all the other nations are gonna keep, but one nation is gonna destroy. It. All right, tonight time is um five fifty. I mean five is it five zero five a.m. in the morning, Wednesday, January twenty fifth, the year of the hopeful, the hopeful year that all prophecies come to pass, and that's a prophecy that um the Lord's gonna destroy one whole nation. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna, I'm gonna surprise you with the name of that nation. <laughs> Let me find the verse. All right. Let me go there real fast. That's all I can. Just want to get that verse real quick. Um, this is a powerful verse, so we're just gonna get it. One chapter, one verse. I'm gonna stop playing. Okay. It's um Obadiah chapter one verse eighteen. Right. It's, it's a beautiful verse and surprise. Let's see who's gonna be um no more. It says Obadiah chapter 1 verse 18. And the house of Jacob shall be a fire. And the house of Joseph a flame. And the house of Esau for stubble. And they, and they shall kindle in them. And devour them. And they... And there shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau. For the Lord Yahweh El Shah has spoken it. So it's just, just reading what, what it says in the scriptures. I don't you know what I mean. Just want to bring that out. Just get to that point. Let's see what it says in the, T, the NLT translation. Just because. I just want to see it. I want to see how they word that one. Powerful <laughs> stuff, man. Hey, waking up. You know, 
Just hoping to get up out of here, man. Hoping to be one of those men preserved. Oh, oh boy, you in trouble, Joshua. Um, it says, Obadiah chapter 1, verse 18, the NLT translation. To clarify the people, okay? All right, this is, look what it says. The people of Israel will be a raging, rage, oh my goodness, this is raging. You're done. Oh my goodness. Tell me, man. Raging. 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 Showing violent, uncontrollable anger. Raging. Continuing with a great force of, I mean, or intensity. Oh, man. Tumultuous. I think. Is that? So I can see what that word is. Tremendous. Tremendous. Salakia. Tremendous. 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 All right, Salakia. So, um, wow. The, um, Obadiah chapter 1 verse 18 The people of Israel Will have a raging fire And Edom A field of dry stubble Oh shit Boy oh boy let's read that again The people of Israel Will have a raging fire And Edom A flame of a field of dry stubble. The descendant of Joseph will be a flame roaring across the field, devouring everything. There will be no survival. We're done. Survivor. Oh, boy. The, the, the descendants of Joseph will be a flame roaring across the field, devouring everything, and there will be no survivors in Edom. I, the Lord Yahweh El Shah, have spoken. Oh, boy, you I mm -hmm. just want to see how. Oh, yo, my, my goodness, you're done. So, so I can, let's see something. Let's go back. So, this um, nation, Edom, um, it said it will be a field of stubble. So, you're going to be gone. I don't know what to tell you, buddy. There's no way for, there's no room for, there's no room for repentance for you. You're not going to, you're not made to repent. You're not made to be reserved. So, right there, that clear clarification that, He's not um having any mercy. It says that in the Zion of the Bible dictionary that there's no um um I go okay. No room for mercy or something like that. I forgot how it went, but it's a lot good. Alright, so let's go back. Let's we we shall we're trying to get some mercy for us, man. Which make logical sense, man. Because we we've been in this world, we we we, we um we seen right now, you know, Pastor Cabal always say that um I do he got that from um King Masha. Um that um um we got or maybe Yaikwa, we're making a full turn. We learned the full thing of wickedness. So that's what happened. We're learning now. Man, look at this, look what they've done to our earth, look what they've done to the people, our servants. It's the other nations, you know? Look what they've done to all our properties, our inheritance. So we, we got to think, if we, we, if we have a ruler class matter, if we have a ruler class mentality, 
That's how you should think. And we are joint heirs, and we hoping to be joint heirs. We got to think like joint heirs. We know we're servants right now. Because the scripture speaks about, um, I see princes, I see servants upon horses, and um, princes walk, something like that. So, we're seeking to be joint heirs. We want to be preserved all the way to the end. We want to be one of them. And that's our mission. So, Salat, um, Psalms chapter 40, verse 11. With, withhold not thy tender mercy. From us, Negro, um, us remnant, the rem, the hopeful remnant, which is the one third. Okay, withhold not thy tender mercy from us, O Yahweh Yah, Shah. Let thy loving kindness and thy truth continually preserve us. So we need to be preserved, man. We need to be the. We need to be protected. You know, like Apostle Gabal said, we need to be, first we need to protect it from ourselves. Help me not sin no more. Help us not sin no more. Y'all watch me out. keep us on a clear path to you. And that's um, what we need. Thinking right now. <coughs> mm. And um, you know, just finding verses this up in this morning. Yeah. Um, we need this, man. We need we need the Lord to um hear us, hear us our prayer, our prayers, and um our supplication, and we gotta have a contrary spirit. We gotta be humble. We gotta be meek. So uh, yeah, we gotta we gotta come lowly to the Lord, man. We need Him, man. We need Yahweh Yah Shah. We can't do this without him. Psalms chapter 69, verse 16. Hear me, O Yahweh, O Shah, for thy loving kindness is good. Turn unto me, uh, turn unto us according to the multitude of thy tender mercy. We need that tender mercy, man. You know, thinking about it, man, I'm like, I, don't, I don't know what the hell I would be doing right now. With myself, man, like I think about, you know, you know how you rekindle the flame. That was the word I was trying to use the last time. Rekindle the flame of your old life. You look back at it. That shit's scary. It's back there. Oh shit! What the fuck is that? You know, and you don't look back as you look back. You you see it around most people. People smoking these stink cigarettes, stink weed. That shit stink. It's not supposed to be burnt like that. It's not. Oh, we 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 need mercy, man. And y'all and you brothers and sisters, keep this in mind. You're coming out of the world of being a sinner. You're still a sinner. We ain't we ain't out the woods yet. That's why we begging the Lord for mercy, man. When it's Jacob trouble, hit us all with the L's now. But we want that great big W. You know. Once this, once this C hip drop, shit gonna speed up quick. Once this dollar collapse, shit gonna speed up so fast you can feel it. It's gonna be another part of the roller coaster. You know, we going up, 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 up the roller coaster. 
And when it gets to the top, it's gonna whoosh. Man. It's gonna be all worth it, man. It's all worth it. Like a, um like the elder brother said, he said, it's gonna be worth it's gonna be rough. So to the fact like that it's gonna be all a lot of trouble, but it's gonna be all worth it. You know, we have great analogies from from great men that's been put before us to get to this next stage. The water yapa shimmer shah for the apostles and elders a great millstone. Um Yeah, man. I'm so locked. I'm just reading the verse. Just trying to get another one before I close out. But we ain't time. I'm going to try not to go too far. So, you know. All right. We're going to end it with this one. We're going to skip a verse. And, um, matter of fact, we're going to read both of these verses. This is Psalms chapter 40, verse 12. The innumerable evil has compassed about. Compassed us about my my our iniquity have taken hold upon upon us so i say us because i'm talking about the remnant so that i so that we are so that so that so that we and we are not able to look hold look up they are more than the hairs of our head. Therefore, my our heart falleth, faileth. So we don't want to, you know, we go through things, but, oh man, because we want to get out of here, man. So we're going to end it with this one. Psalms 40, verse 13. Please, O oh, Yahweh, our shall deliver us. Please, O oh, Yahweh, our shall deliver us. O oh, Yahweh, our shall make haste to help us. Please, Lord, speed this up. Make it faster. It's happening, though. I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh. Just a quick one. Shalom to the Akim. Do I have a Shalom for the apostles? No, this great millstone. Shalom. Shalom.